Okay, my phone goes weird, so I'm going to try to keep it plugged in where I can show this, because um, some of the recipes that how to make and do it, they just, they get lost. So, there's, this is part two, okay, of um, oven baked barbecue chicken. It should be crispy by the time it's over, so. Anyhow, but what you want to have is um, an injector, right? Now, my injector changed on me because it only had one spot, but if you turn it around, it's got two spots. So, what the fuck? Had this shit for about fucking four years. Uh, now, it's got two. So, that's fucking way this place alters around. Okay, so, hold on. Okay, never mind um, the injections because I should not have added the garlic minced garlic into there because it's getting sucked up in this thing and it won't work so what I'm just gonna do is I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna stab it into the chickens and just poke holes in it basically because um, I'm not remaking that sauce so I'm gonna stab all these chickens and as you can tell there's, there's legs and stuff down there so let me do that first not at least let it soak into there. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, I got all that kind of stabbed up or whatnot. But the oven's been at 400, so it's preheated. And what I did is I took a big ass pan and um, what that is is extra virgin olive oil. So hold on. Alright, so now. What I'm gonna do is the dump. Hold on. Okay, so doing it this way. And I don't know what the world is with this place, and uh, not using your hands um, to cook. It's like it's honestly ridiculous. It's not, I don't know. Uh, yeah. You do is wash your hands, but you got to use your hands. And get into the nitty gritty the same way with the engine you know if you're gonna mess with the engine or anything else um you're gonna get dirt and you know we drink from the water hoses and shit like that so it's like what the fuck are we doing here you know like, oh i gotta put on rubber gloves to make my fucking chicken so i can eat it give me a fucking break um but it's things i've noticed um it's 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 <sighs> It's the weirdest thing, you know, I mean, I was a kid, and I collect, well, I collected, basically, you know, loved turtles, and so, mom would drive me around, and I'd pick up turtles, and I had over 150 land turtles at one time, and then, when I got older, you know, had them all, we had a big field, we had about five acres, one I had a big pen, and had a great turtle escape when the storm blew through, and, um, the, the boards fell over, and all the turtles <laughs> got out, and, um, most of them did, and, um, they went all over the neighbor's yards. Um, neighbors all over the place, you know. But, um, but yeah, and, and um, you know, salmonella wasn't a thing for me. I mean, say a drink out of the, the water hose, when you ride your bike all day, the last place you want to be was inside the fucking house. Okay, so I'm just going to do this kind of stuff in here. And then, um, and, and yeah, somewhere along the way, um, you know, everything we used to do is just all of a sudden not right. You know, forced to grow up on our own, forced to, um, Nobody really gave a shit about us. Hold on. Let's 
scoop this stuff out of here and look at this. It was just a thing, though. Um, and it was totally normal, you know. Because every fucking parent, you know, no kid want to be inside when your fucking parents were talking or hanging around the family and shit because you're about to get your ass whooped. Unless you just sit over there and, and kept your mouth shut and just watched and observed. You, you had no option of um, giving in input most of the time. Because um, this wasn't the way it was. And um, I'm, I'm, not that that's a good thing. But um, it did teach us to um, be uh, more independent. Basically. Um, but So if you hear me, I'm washing my motherfucking hands. A raw chicken with and ain't fucking nothing gonna happen. No fucking kind of crazy ass fucking what you may call it woogie boogies I'm fucking handling damn chicken I'm gonna put in my damn body and I do need to give thanks so thank you chicken um I'm sorry for what you went through here But I do appreciate the wrongnesses that will make a right into my body. I want to thank you and wish you well journeys onto the next phase of where you're going. And I love you. Okay. So I got uh set four hundred <clears throat> and um I'm uh, fixing to put some temple over this and put it in there. And um I'll, I'll keep y'all posted. <laughs>